Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Game of Thrones. This guy does not look good. Ooh, look at the. <gasps> what the f I thought he was a zombie. Is he surrounded by dead bodies? Is that what all those fry the flies are for? That's gotta be it, right? There's maggots. Oh, what the fudge. Roderick Forrester, King's Road. Not long now. Damn foresters. Have to be so fucking far away. Speak up, bro! Wow, he passed back out. This is not good. That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. Alright, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Royland. You again! <laughs> Who you got this time? Some poor peasant dressed up like a I, lord, uh, a stable boy was, in Bannerman's clothes. Sir Ryan. You did this at Duskendale, <clears throat> and you have the fucking stones to try it again. No, I... This house has suffered the loss of many good men, and you dare come here claiming to have Forrester dead. They're Forrester. Look at the colors. Fine <sighs> trick. I'm sure it leaves. <laughs> now. Fine. I'll dump them in the river then. <sighs> Hurry up and you speak up, bro. Come again. on. You won't be leaving. You got that? Aye, oh, I heard you! That was a sheep fucker. <coughs> I'm sorry, sir. I don't worry you, sir. <coughs> Seven hours. <coughs> what is it, sir? This one's still alive. You there? Who are you? It's me. Roderick. Roderick? Roderick? By oh, the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! <laughs> Fetch the maester! Roderick! <sighs> well, that was close. Should not be awake. The milk of a puppy. Drink. Come now. That's it. He's just trying to help you. Roderick! My lady! No. I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. How is he? Will he live? Let him. Sir, my lady, I must insist that you leave. No. Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, you may never walk again. Roderick? What's wrong with him? He drank the milk of the poppy. Please don't leave me. Not yet. Hopefully we wake up. Damn, dude, this is an intense, intense episode so far. What the hell? Ooh, we look like we got some color back in our face. We got some clothes on. We're looking, looking a lot better. Go 
Oh, shut up. <laughs> I haven't heard that one before. It's nice. Roderick, thank the gods. Brother, I think oh, I lost oh. you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Come here, sister. How bad is it? <laughs> Maestor Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. And your face. These wounds will heal, Talia. I know. You'll be your old self before we know it. Roderick, there's something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Ethan? Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Like it was nothing. Ethan? How could this happen to him? We'll make Ramsay pay for what he did. I promise. Good. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove, alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. <laughs> you can, Dahlia. I know you can. Show some confidence. been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lord. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. Council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Can you even stand? They could use your leadership. Only one way to find out. I missed you, brother. You can do this, Roderick. You can do it, buddy. Come on. I know you can. Get up. You got it. There we go. Hey, just one foot in front of the other. Come on, baby. Oh, shit. Roderick. I'm fine. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. I need to attend that meeting. And you will. But you will get there on your feet. It's a long way to the Great Hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. Thank you, Talia. Dude, his face looks disgusting. Ready? Good lord, it looks like he was mauled by like a bear. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Everyone will be so glad to see you up. Though... I think you'll find that much has changed. What a good sister.
Jared Tuttle, Castle Black. Castle Black. So this is the seat of the Night's Watch. The wall. Always wanted to see it. Not like this. So this is where they sent us to the wall. Another one for Frostfinger. On a horse, no less. <laughs> Real friendly around here, huh? like it was built by giants, doesn't it? the hell is that thing? You're that new, the... here to take the black. The lift? Because mm. you got that look about you. I need to speak to the Lord Commander. We, uh, don't have one right now. It's Frostfinger you want. He'll get you sorted out. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> It's just his way. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. All right, let's go talk to him. Frostfinger, that's kind of an interesting name, right? Oh, shoot, I can see why. Your Frostfinger. You recruits. You come, you train, you fight, you die. Who are you, boy? I'm Garrett Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Garrett Tuttle of Ironrath. And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the wall? You're a thief. A raper. You abandon your post. I killed the men who murdered my family. Then you know how to fight, at least. And Gotta you know sound like a badass either. to him. Sir? From no, Duncan Tuttle, that. Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit. But then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You are a killer. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. Yes, sir. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. Oh, and Tuttle. Sooner or later, the Night's Watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. 